Hey guys, I hope that you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more Rimworld, and uh, we return after a bit of a poor showing from our last campaign, or our last episode. Uh, we lost Bloodbound, and we lost, um, who was the other one, actually? Oh my goodness, let me get my list up. Bloodbound and Lambda? No, it wasn't Bloodbound and Lambda. Bloodbound and... Who was it? Michaelis. No, not Michaelis. The Bitter Steel. Oh, unfortunate. They were the most recent, too. So, feels bad, man. But uh, we will come back from it. It's not uh, the end of the world, as much as we do hate to lose our beloved members of our squad. Um, we will come back from it. It's not going to be the end of the world. But uh, we're definitely going to be needing to um, figure out what's going on here. Um... So these guys are going to attack. Uh, harassing our caravan. Oh yeah, she's dead too. We're going to get attacked here by these guys. There's not really much I can do about it. Let's take a look at our work and make sure that we have everybody that we need to still. So we still have two researchers. We ha still have doctors. We have a warden. We don't have an animal handler, but that's okay. We have a cook. We have a constructor. Palmer. We have our growers. Okay, we're okay. We have all of our major things sorted out. Transport pod, Jeff. Hello, Jeff. Tell me about yourself. You are not very good. He is a fast walker who can do plants and animals. Maybe some intellectual. We'll capture him. I don't see why not. It doesn't make any sense not to, but... Um, no promises. We do have a warden. What is his health issue? No real issues, just some cuts and stabs on his arm, so he should be good to go. Heal him up. Ideally, Corbett's gonna get Michaelis back in here very soon. Very high recruitment chance, so it should be shouldn't be too hard. And uh, now we wait until tomorrow. Yes, Michaelis went on a uh, slaughter spree and was going to kill our animals, which looks like they're all dead anyways. Because uh, I don't know what happened to the horse. Oh, the horse got killed. I'm not sure what happened to the muffalo, though. That is something I'm a little concerned about. But Jeff has an infection. So Lambda, I would like for you to go tend to him as well, please. He can go ahead and have... Um, yeah. Do we not have any heal root? We don't. Interesting. Okay, well, he's going to get no medicine tonight, because I'm not going to give him my medicine. But uh, we will go ahead and get him some, some medicine here soon. So it's really cold outside. Matter of fact, it might be too cold for everybody. No, we're okay right now. Hmm. Let's go ahead and... Uh, we don't really have any wood left either, do we? Do we have any wood? We have no wood. Goodness gracious. Okay, well. Let's go ahead and uh, build some campfires around here. No. Let's go ahead and build some heaters. Heaters are fine. Um, do something like this and this. Something like this and this. Something like this, and this, and that should be fine. Hyperthermia, yeah. Hopefully they don't try to run, there we go. Build the heater, there we go. That'll raise the temperature up. Everybody will be happier because of it. As long as they stay inside, it doesn't matter if it's a little chilly, right? Unfortunately, that will... I was going to say, we're very low on the power, though. 
So we're gonna need some wood though. So let's go ahead and uh, chop some wood around here. Something like this will be good. We have some heal root now, so we'll be able to get Jeff treated with medicine, which will be good for him. His immunity is, is increasing, so that'll be good. Let's harvest the ones we can. There we go. Definitely want some more heal root than we have right now. And he got a crappy treatment, but that's fine. Lots of wood getting cut down. Beautiful. I reckon it's probably these guys that are... No. They don't take that much. Build some braziers over here. Major break risk in Corbett. What's going on? Bloodbound? Yeah. Honestly, Corbett, that's that, nothing's going to change there, brother. You're going to be having a bad time, man. Friend, lover. The colonists were lost. Though the slept in cold one will be going away. Acetic has a mediocre bedroom, so he's an acetic. So, Corbett, you don't need a nice room anymore. So we can actually go ahead and remove the floor here. And, uh, I didn't realize he was an ascetic. Okay. Goodness gracious. Michaela should get recruited tomorrow, hopefully. Um. Not so sure how I feel about you. Honestly, I don't really want you. Rhea is a rough outlander tribe, so they're probably never really going to like me. So it doesn't really make sense for me to release them, I don't think. So probably not going to. At the very least, we can just sell them. Medical emergency. He'll be okay. Hopefully Corbett can get, uh, get settled on that stuff. go broken the resistance very good it's just a bummer it's just such a huge waste of time because they're just eating all the food and they're getting they're contributing very little okay we have our final raid of this uh oops click the wrong button there come on now no need to generate so these guys will prepare for a while and then attack so it's a uh, one rifle and two things so we're to uh Maces, is that what they're called? We'll be fine. We will be totally fine. So, just gonna let everybody kind of sit tight for a little bit. Minor break risk. Yeah. Corbett is honestly gonna be feeling pretty crappy all the way up until um, these mal effects wear off. Another raid. Hold on a second. Another raid? I know we have this one. There is a second raid. Oh my gosh, hey. Well, luckily they're all melee, which is good. I wonder, are they just running up automatically? They are. Alright, cool. Let's go ahead and get you guys over here then. Uh, we'll have Palmer with his rifle over here. Shotgun down here. Machine pistol over here. And Jaren, you can come over here as well. Actually have you stand out here in the middle. And now we're just going to hold off and wait. So let's take a look at who these guys are. You are quite a good shooter. Shooter, miner, crafter. Goodness gracious, you're a good character. I would like to have you. He's already a ding. He's a dingus, apparently, though. If he doesn't die, it's fine with me. Okay, those guys are both dead. <laughs> um, now we just wait until the other guys come on up here. So, is it... What ended up killing these guys? A uh, log. With a machine pistol bullet. Just says he hit him with it. And what about you, friend? Just the spike trap. <laughs> Just hit the spike trap and died. You'll have that, I suppose. Alright, so. This Hayes guy is very slow. He's a slowpoke. Greedy gay slowpoke. Not a bad character, though. 
Okay. Oh, oh, wow. Okay. So you are really good at medical, melee, and intellectual. I would not hate to have you around, but I also would rather kind of not. I'm going to go ahead and release him. His recruitment chance is super high, though. He's not going to be useful. So she just lost, lost her arm and her lung, so never mind. We're, um, dang it, man. We'll keep him. What is he good for again? Animals and plants. Um, we'll release him. That's okay. These guys are not going to make it. We'll be good. Okay, very good. Hayes. Um, let's go ahead and actually just chase him down. He's not going to run away, this greedy, gay, slow poke. <laughs> Come on, get him. <clears throat> I do want Jaren to attack him. Got him. Oh, that's so good. Get him. Get him. There we go. Nice. That's what you get. That is what you get. We're also going to want to deconstruct all this stuff over here because this is free steel, you know? And free steel is good steel as far as I'm concerned. Um, this is all granite or, or sandstone, one of the two. They look very similar, so might as well get it anyways, right? Any more ruins that I should be thinking of? Doesn't look like it. These horses look pretty good. So there's a lot of steel over here that I could be getting. I would like it, but we'll get it when we can get it. Mm. You. Um, medical, I guess if they don't have an arm, it doesn't matter. Medical is going to need it. I'm okay with um, how long are they going to live for? Do I need to even worry about it? No, they're not going to make it. Let's go ahead and strip them. Do they have any good gear? No. Never mind. Go ahead and finish them off. Okay. And uh, that's it for you guys. Had a little bit of wake up, very good. Another raid, goodness gracious. A machine pistol and a, a gladius, interesting. What do you have here? So this is actually a pretty good character, Ally, or Ally. You not so much, you're actually bad at shooting, you're the only one with a gun, so. Uh, I'm not sure if they were attacking right away, kinda hope they do. Looks like they are, yes. Let's go ahead and just have you guys hang back here. I don't really think anything's gonna happen here. Have uh, you guys hang out over here. There we go. I always love it when the first shot hits. Kind of don't want to kill this one. Okay, never mind. They're dead. I want Lambda to chase him down. Oh, no. He stepped on the trap. Okay, never mind. These traps are, like, overpowered, honestly. We haven't struggled at all with killing them. Um, okay, so this one's done, then. Jeff exited the map, and there we go. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that one. So, Corbett should be doing better now that his awful bedroom. So, that'll give him a little bit of a boost. Michaelis is back. Thank God. Looks like they kept all their previous stuff, so they can be the cook again. Lambda can be construction and uh, plant cutting. So let's go ahead and actually chop some more wood. Gonna need to be hauling as well. All right. We have a lot of beds right now. Uh, 
Okay. So, then there were five. <laughs> uh, we're gonna need to definitely build up some, uh, some more graves over here. I had somebody had asked, like, hey, can't your food go... Can it spoil? Well, being... If you leave uh, dead bodies in their freezer? Mm, I don't think so. As far as I know, no. The reason why I do it is just so they don't spoil in between the time that I go to uh, plant them. Uh, plant them. Uh, bury them, because if you bury them, or if you bury... If you go near a rotten corpse, it affects your mood more adversely. So That's my justification. Muffalo meat has rotted away in storage. Interesting. We have a manhunter pack of capybaras. One single capybara. And boy, is he mad. Watch him step on a trap. Watch it. Watch this capybara step on a trap and die. He's gonna step on this guy right here. Oh. Okay. No problem. <laughs> Getting everything clean, but I need you guys to uh, haul as well. Let's go ahead and haul all these weapons in as well. The melee ones I don't necessarily care nearly as much about, but... Man, Corbett's doing good. Burning pan- or Jaren, this is Jaren. You get a good mood, man. Okay, everybody seems to be doing pretty good. It's unfortunate that we're stuck with these where we're at right now. I'm, I'm, I'm wanting to do a bit more of progression, but we'll see. All these guns are poor. For those of you who don't know, poor quality does actually affect uh, shooting, so. So this is brightly lit, which is good. Oh, it's daytime, so it's all brightly lit. The reason why I put these here is so it can light up our area, so we can shoot into it. And this will be dark, and people won't be able to see. But it doesn't actually look like... I think it stays lit at 50%, if I'm correct. Yeah, okay. So this does stay at 50%. So people can get shot in here, we can see them, but they can't see us as much. That might be... I think that's correct. But I also might be wrong. Oh, it looks like we're running out of power. Um, okay, well, let's go ahead and build a copy of that right here then. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and mine this out. Who's our, who's our best miner? It would be Palmer. So Palmer, if you wouldn't mind, prioritize mining. Mining, I, I mean to say. There we go. Let's go ahead and build that copy there. Now let's also make sure we have a roof area put over that. That will solve our power issues. And then we're going to need to get some batteries sometime soon as well. Luckily it's just the heater in here, so it's not a big deal. But uh, we'll get it sorted out. It's not a big deal. Want some more of that music. Wait, did I turn the music off? Oh, I turned the music off. There we go. I turned music off for some reason. What was I doing? I'm sorry I robbed you of this beautiful music, friends. Looks like our corn isn't going to make it either. So we're actually getting a little low on the food. So let's go ahead and... Um, kill a muffalo. Who's my hunter? Just Palmer. Yeah. Hmm, so it is refrigerated, so that's nice. Just need to kill one of them, realistically, it'll be good to go. There we go. Well, when I say we only need one, but that's definitely not the truth, but we'll see. One probably would get us through, like, the next two days. Hmm. Yeah, it's a bummer that we don't have more, um... 
Can you guys please haul this stuff? We definitely need more people to haul. She's hauling. Good. Just need to haul, man. We need to honestly need people who are not good at stuff, who aren't useful. <laughs> uh, finished researching machine. Machining, which is good. Let's go with gunsmithing. Um, let's actually build a machining table in our workshop over here. Probably somewhere down here we'll, we'll get access to the... Uh, to these workbenches. It's okay if we clear off a little bit of the uh, things here. We don't want to hold this open anymore either. Let some heat build up in here is fine. I have a visitor from the Pact of Galga. Very cool. A new psychic drone, low for females. Well, not ideal, but we'll take it. Cool. And so as far as what we can build right now, frag grenades and simple helmets. Um, some cocktails. What do we need for that? Cloth and chem fuel. Well, we don't have that. Chem fuel and steel. What do we need for this? Just steel, I assume. Yeah, let's go ahead and make a couple of them then. Who do we have for smithing? Six from Lambda? Yeah, that's fine. Don't be doing research if you could be smithing or crafting. That'll make Lambda do the, uh... He'll default to doing these two. Stone cutting and all that stuff as well, which is gonna be good for us. So this guy's got some stuff to trade. Doesn't look like it's actually much, but I will have Corbett run out just to say hello and see what he's got going. So we can sell him some cloth, but it's probably not necessary. We can definitely sell him some herbal meds, but I don't want to do that. We have some psych IT that I'm willing to part with. Um, I definitely want to give you like all of our poor weapons, clear out our inventories a bit. You can have that. I'll keep the pants. Those are pretty good. And I will also part with all these poopy weapons. The Gladius I'm kind of tempted to stick with, but it's also poor as well, so... I'll get rid of all of it, it's fine. And, uh, Psychic Animal Pulsar we want to get rid of eventually, but... The incendiary shells look cool. Give you the wake up. He doesn't have enough, but, uh... It's only two, two silver off, so that's fine. We're good. I am willing to do that. Winter has begun, unfortunately. So let's actually quit sowing these. Because they're just going to keep planting them, and then it's not going to actually work, which is annoying, so. Okay. A mad rat. Interesting. And an eclipse. Such a waste of steel. Such a waste. So it is nice and warm in here. Not nice and warm, but it is warm, I should say. Um... The torches will keep it a bit warm in here, so I suppose it's not a huge deal. Alright, Lambda's getting to work on some helmets. It would be nice to get some helmets for our people. Very good. We're gonna need some more food. A war merchant, interesting. Okay. Let's get ourselves another muffalo. Palmer, if you wouldn't mind. Lambda's building up sub some helmets, which is beautiful. Shoot him up. Oh no, come on now. This is not what I wanted. Oh, it's okay. These guys are gonna defend me. Maybe. I'm not sure where they go or where they're going actually. Almer is not that fast. Oh no. This is kinda bad actually. Oh, no, 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 no. They're fast. They're catching up to him. No. All right, let's get everybody over here. No, it... Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. This is bad. Crap. Well, they won't finish him off, so that's good. But they will probably... Um... Okay, so the one is dead. Where's Corbett at? He's on his way. Okay, so they're dead. We're good. 
Definitely want you to uh, go rescue him. There we go. Okay, cool. Well, that was unfortunate. Well, we got three more. So, three more buffaloes. Hopefully Palmer didn't get any, like, major damage done to him. That would be unfortunate. It should just be bruises, as far as I know. A mad buck. What in the world is up with these animals going crazy on me? There you go. He got hit by a deer leg. So, Palmer, um, Lambda, I need you to go ahead and uh, tend to him. You'll be good to go, my friend. And uh, I would like Corbett to come over here and see what's going on with Snake! 20 herbal meds, so uh, what are you selling me, brother? The wool parka is nice, so that's super expensive. Look at the cloth parka. I will take that, for because Michaelis is going to need it. I can actually sell you the Neuro Trainer. So you don't have any real weapons that I want. Apila. <laughs> um... I suppose this is a good trade. The pemmican might be useful, but I think we are gonna be good without it. So let's go ahead and just buy the pants and sell the Neuro Trainer. That'll give everybody a jacket. And then, uh... Lambda's taking care of Palmer. So that's good. Really? You're using all those meds for that, dude? I'm gonna say, why did you bring four of them? Dang, we really are low on the medicines. Alright, let's see who can help out Lambda. So Jaren can. He is okay though, I suppose it's not an issue. Hmm. Okay, cool. Well that is gonna do it for this one. I hope you guys are enjoying, and if you are, please show your support and leave a like. Subscribe if you have not already and you want to see some more RimWorld. And uh, if you want to check out the Discord or support what I do via Patreon and get your name on one of these colonists, the uh, link for those are both in the description down below. And with all that being said, this is Chewy Shoot, and I'll catch you guys later. A big special thanks to my top supporters on Patreon, Bloodbound92 and Palmer, as well as Jaren Clampett, Lambda Driver, Corbett Gaming, Michael Walker, Gregory the Bitter Steel, Jonathan Crane, Airborne Animal 7, as well as the rest of you guys. I appreciate all you so much. If you want to check out a couple of my other series I have going on, those are going to be linked on the left and right, and don't forget to subscribe.